you guys a story about uh, when I had to carry around an inflatable butt for, for the first two weeks of my freshman year of high school. Uh, it all started when I was 11 years old, actually, and it started with me learning how to play guitar. Uh, I had just gone and saw the Kiss and Ted Nugent. It was my first concert ever, so I decided that I was going to be a guitarist. And um, going from there, I started, well, I got in the band when I turned 13. Uh, it was my first band, and they actually had a show book, so it was going to be my first concert ever, and I was really excited. And, um, when we got there, we were, you know, setting up and sound checking, and they told us that uh, the first, the band that was supposed to headline had canceled, so we were actually headlining the show. And this was at uh, the Green Door, which, if any of you don't know, the Green Door back then was uh, kind of a these names for local music. It was the place to play. It was all the cool kids were there and stuff. Uh, so I was really excited. And uh, we were, like I said, we were headlining. So I was even cooler, I thought. You know, I figured, oh, redlining is a main band that will make us play better. I mean, than it really. But um, so as we were sound checking, I look and the, the speaker setup at the green door is a uh, there's a three foot main, and then there's two stacked on top of each other. So it's a three foot, and then a three foot, and a three foot, so six feet. Um, so I got it in my head that I was gonna get up on to the six feet and jump off, or I didn't, hadn't really planned it out that far, just that I'm gonna get up here and do something stupid. Uh, so I do so, I get up, I stand up there for a minute, I actually thought I'd pulled it off and done whatever I was planning on it doing. Uh, and then I go to jump off, and in doing so, I land on my guitar cable, which in turns made my feet slip right out from under me, and I land on my pedal board, which is a board with about uh, six metal boxes, basically. Uh, so I land on that, and just this sharp shooting pain shoots up from my back. I mean, my whole body is hurting. Um, we have two songs left, so I just stand there and look away from the crowd because I'm really embarrassed because I had told all my friends how cool I was and to come check me out and uh, yeah so I go to the doctor the next day and uh, they do an x-ray and this is about a, four days before my freshman year started at a new school where I really didn't know anybody uh, and they told me it was broken and that I had to get an inflatable butt pillow to carry around school with me and set in because of the desks being hard and whatnot and uh, I didn't really contest too much because I was like, oh, that's fine, I have a locker now. I'll just put it in there. Uh, but come to find out, we didn't get our lockers until a week into school. So for that first week, uh, every day I was stuck carrying around 